I didn't understand it. <laughs> You may not have understood what she signed either, but there are people who don't hear who didn't understand what he said because they couldn't see his lips to read them or because they are hard of hearing and would have to strain to hear him. But no more. During this run of Children of a Lesser God, those who are hard of hearing can, for $2, rent a wireless infrared sound listening system. Very simply put, the microphones around the stage pick up what is said by the actors, and that goes through the radiator transmitter, which sends out an invisible beam to the headsets. The beam is harmless and can't be interrupted by two-way radios or CBs. Mary Rose says the system is a godsend. We'll be able to follow the play and, and uh, just uh, hear every word, and that means so much, means so much to us. I, I know I, oftentimes I sit there and I haven't picked up the word. I am hoping that more theaters will go to it because it's very advantageous to the handicap. Many people won't come to the theater because they can't hear the show. Everyone who uses the system is asked to rate it in writing. And what's important about that is if enough people like it, maybe the Memorial Arts Center will make it part of their regular equipment and will make theater going a lot easier for the hearing impaired. This is a show for everybody since a lot of it is signed and spoken. The play is about a speech therapist who can hear, who falls in love with a woman who can't hear. Children of a Lesser God will be at the Memorial Arts Center through Sunday.